And same time. Oh, this might have worked. There we go. That is it. We just did it there. If you replay that, this Miramit is over 500 meters away. I have found an insane scorpion teleportation bug, and it allows you to teleport 11 up to 1100 meters across the map. We have three scorpions loaded up. I think it also works with the Revenant, so in the second game, we'll try it out with the Revenant. To remind you, the scorpion backstab ability has a 350 meter range, all right? This allows you to go 1100 meters. So let's get into a game and I'm gonna show you guys or try to show you guys this bug that's been around for a while and players have been exploiting it, but I figured I'd show everyone so everyone at least knows about it and everyone's kind of on the same playing field. So let's get into a game and let's do this. Okay, factory map. This map should work and obviously we're dropping the scorpion first. It's so weird too because I really am a huge fan of the scorpion robot, especially the last couple months when the siren and harpy have existed. So pretty much what this is, is you're rotating target lock-ons while you're using your ability, okay? So hold on here, I'm trying to, oh, friggin' meatball sub, this guy's already at our, okay, this is not, this is not the bug, I just had to clear that guy out, look at all these scorpions. So like I said, I'm not showing this so that, you know, to, so everybody can exploit the game or whatever, this bug has been around for a while, and... It's like some players know about it, some don't, and obviously it's a huge advantage if some know about it and others don't, so. I figured I'd just show everybody, everybody knows about it, everyone's on the same playing field until it gets fixed. Okay, so what has to happen is, there has to be two enemies in front of me. What I'm trying to do right now. One within 350 meters of range, and then the other further than 350. So I go back and forth with the targeting, just between i'm trying to do it right now this is annoying did that work that did not work okay we didn't get it yet we did not get it yet so i'm going to remind you one two enemies in front of us one within 350 so our ability should actually work against them and then another player oh we're going to die here too further than 350 and that's the one that we're going to teleport to which is obviously shouldn't be able to happen so we go back and forth. Hold on, hold on. Let me, uh... So I gotta get two enemies in front of me. Okay, can we go here? No, that's not it. Ah, you can't lock on to a third enemy. You have to have two people in front of you, two players. Nope, it keeps going to that guy. I'm trying to... Oh man, it, the hardest part is just positioning the lock-ons. Because you get the two players in front of you, and then... You go back and forth, so you target lock onto the far guy, target lock onto the close guy, and then at the same time, you hit the ability button and the target lock on, so it goes to the further player, and then you teleport to that player. Bro. Oh. No, see? Oh, the guy. That would have worked, but the guy went in stealth, the guy at the far distance, so we couldn't actually lock onto him. Okay, let's try to get this beacon. Hopefully, I'm not damaging my team too much. Sorry, team. I'm trying to just show this bug. I'm doing it for the greater good of War Robots. Uh, yeah, yeah, yikes. Okay, hold on. Yeah, and this bug's been around for a long time. This is not like a recent bug where it's popped up in like popped up like a week ago. Okay, let's see if we can do this again. So I need two players in front of me, and I need to target lock on just to those players back and forth. Actually, while we're over here, let's grab this beacon. Let's grab this beacon. Come on, come on. Get the beacon. Get the beacon. Okay, let's shield up. And here we go. Okay, this guy. Okay, these two guys here. Let's see if we can do it. That guy's five over 500 meters away. And same time. Oh, this might have worked. There we go. That is it. We just did it there. If you replay that, this Miramit is over 500 meters away. And we teleported to him. And we just teleported back to the same spot. That should not be able to happen for obvious reasons. The scorpion ability should only be able to do 350 meters. But let's try to do it again. Okay, so we went back and forth with the targeting. And then we hit the ability and the lock on button at the exact same time. Okay, same time. It happened again. It just happened again. Okay, I think we're getting used to it now. This is happening now. So I know some of you are probably saying, you're like, oh, why are you showing this bug to everyone? Now even more players are going to exploit it. And I'm thinking in my head, I'm like, wait, 
there's already a ton of players that know about this. Like, players have told me about this bug over months and months. Like, I don't know how long this has existed, but it's been months and months and months. So I think in my head, I'm like, okay, I think it's better that everybody kind of knows about this bug rather than just 25% of players because then there's no advantage to knowing about it, you know? I'm pretty sure that makes sense in my head. Maybe I'm an idiot, but let me know what you guys think. Uh-oh, okay. In the meantime, we're getting four capped and I have not helped my team it's out very much. Oh, we're gonna die. Oh, baloney sandwich, okay. We spent that whole game trying to reveal that scorpion bug, but it definitely exists. When I was told about this, I wasn't 100% sure, but it definitely exists, man. Okay, let's see if we can do it again here. This is the revenant this time. 430, I think it's gonna work. There we go again. So it works with the revenant too. With the revenant, we just teleported 430 meters. And the reason it only goes up to 1100 meters is because you can only, if you didn't know, you can only see players that are within 1100 meter range. So that's why that's the max distance. Okay, I'm gonna actually try to win this game, but I think it might be too late. We're gonna have to try another game though. We're gonna try only Revenant Hanger or swap out our Scorpions for Revenants in a second game. Uh oh. Okay, my team's getting four capped. All right, my bad teammates. My bad. I kind of messed up on this one. I was trying to get the bug and we're getting four capped and we're gonna lose this game. My whole team's like mecked out too. That's a little bit weird that my team's like mecking out six minutes into the game. All right, that wasn't great, but we accomplished what I set out to do, which was reveal the scorpion bug. So Pixonic, if you're watching this, this is a current bug in the game and it should definitely be fixed. Oh man, yeah, our damage was crap too. But all right, let's switch up the hangar to Revenants and then go game two, teleportation bug. Okay, Revenants this time. We loaded up Revenants and we're on a roll map. Let's see what we can do. One, I guess you could say good thing about this bug is it's so annoying and so much work to actually use or do that it kind of isn't a massive advantage. I mean, like, sure, teleporting to enemies up to 1,100 meters away is very useful and it would be overpowered if it actually was supposed to normally exist. But it's kind of really annoying to do. So in the fast paced environment of the game, it might be too difficult. Oh man, I'm trying to, that's a behemoth there, okay? Look, this guy's within 350. I'm trying to rotate, same time. There we go. Here we go. Okay, see, last game I was trying to teleport back with the scorpion, so I wasn't actually using the bug, but I can't teleport back now, so I'm, I just killed the beam. <laughs> I can't teleport back with this big meatball sub. Okay, so you telep- you- Hold on, hold on, I'm, I'm uh, tripping out here. I'm trying to run away from these guys. I use the whiteout drone. Whiteout drone, I do not recommend with the revenant. Go with the nebula or the persephone or something. Double kill. Okay. So it's a combination of rotating your target lock while um, using or pressing your ability, your teleportation ability, with two different targets in front of you. One within 350, one further than 350. I just did it again. I just did it again. I used that siren as the close range, and then this guy was the far target, and then I just teleported to that hawk. Okay, so this bug works with the revenants and the scorpions. Jeez, good thing the Kepri or something doesn't have teleportation because this would make it even more ridiculous. All right, all right. We still have, oh man, are we getting four capped again? Okay, I gotta drop in. We need some beacons, man. We need some beacons. Okay, let's see one more time, let's see. Okay, let's teleport. That guy's 430 away, 430. There we go, I think it's gonna work. And this guy was 400 meters away and it just worked again. Okay, this is confirmed, confirmed bug report. Everybody tell Pixonic this. I'm going to tell Pixonic this, but this is definitely a a very real thing. Okay, we're trying to get, get this beacon. Bro, we're getting four cap like two and a half minutes into the game. We're two and a half minutes in. Yikes. Pajama, meatball, fried, apple pie. 
This is actually a weird Revenant build. I have not tried out this Revenant build, but it's actually... I don't know. It seems not bad. These weapons are still so powerful. Uh, hold on, hold on. Now there's two guys in front of me. Come on, come on, come on. Kill. There we go. Also, yeah, this teleportation, it only really works if you have two enemies. Not three. Two enemies exactly in front of you. One close range, one far range. Otherwise, it's way too difficult to... To try to set up. Bro, who just... Oh, what the heck? That was so whack. We got the double kill and just delayed. Okay, let's see if we can get this beacon. Man, my team's down to the beacon bar again. Freaking cheese niblets. Okay, we got taken out there. Um, okay, we're getting four cap now again. Okay, we're just getting rinsed in these games. Pro I'm not really helping my team very much, but... Okay, let's see if we can do a far teleportation here. Okay, this guy's Wilson. This Wilson guy to that Arthur. I'm trying to rotate. Going back and forth. There we go. There it goes again. He's probably like, where did this guy just come from? Okay, so I'm officially declaring this a bug that is in the game. And it's been in the game for a long time. So I don't know if I'm just revealing this. Like, I just found out about this a couple of days ago. So this is a very... Well, I've been told about this before, but I've only tried it, like, right now. Man, look at us just torch up that Arthur. My team's about to lose, though. So even though we exposed the bug, we got rinsed. Oh, we're going to get rinsed in this game, too. We just got absolutely spanked in both these games. All right, we lost both the games, but that is it. The teleportation bug for the Scorpion and the Revenant. It exists. If you watch this video, you now know about this bug. So it's not an advantage, really, for people. Unless, you know, you don't have a Scorpion or Revenant. But everybody knows about it. It's in the game. Pixonic needs to fix it. And that is it. SpaghettiO, cheese balls, peace.